This video will teach you the basic functionalities of the Radflow platform, an artificial intelligence solution designed to streamline and organize the creation of radiology reports. At the top of the screen, you will find the two main options for text generation, the Speech AI Microphone and the AI Assistant. Before using these features, it is important to configure one of your assistants. Click on the down arrow next to the settings icon. Select Add a new assistant. In the Formatting tab, you can choose your preferred formatting options. Select the font, font size, and line spacing. In the Processing tab, you can choose to disable impressions and select the Structured Report format. It is also very important to choose the language in which the report will be generated. In the Prompt tab, you can customize how the assistant will transcribe your text. In the Speech AI tab, we recommend selecting the Leo Speech Engine V2 model. You should also select the voice recognition language and reinforce the prompt with the desired language. Click Add and you're all set. Now, let's see the agents in action. The AI Assistant uses the editor's content as a reference. If there is already text in the editor, the Assistant will build upon that content to generate your report. If the editor is empty, the assistant will use the platform's standard models to create a complete report based on the radiologist's dictated findings. It is important to note that when the editor is empty, you must mention the study title at the beginning of the recording. This helps direct the system to the correct agent for the study being evaluated, ensuring a more precise report. When you start recording, you can dictate the entire report freely. There is no need to pause and resume frequently even if someone interrupts you, the assistant will transcribe only the relevant content for the report you are working on. Check out this example. When the editor is empty, it's always important to clearly edit the study title so that it can be directed to a specific agent. Assistant, please give me a normal brain MRI. When there's already a template or a previous report in the editor, you can interact with it. With this report, just ask to include the changes. Assistant, please include a recent acute ischemic area in the right frontal lobe. Notice that it described the acute ischemic area in the cerebral parenchyma section. and also included this change in the diagnostic impressions. This makes creating reports very practical without needing to edit paragraph by paragraph. Speech AI allows voice-to-text transcription using artificial intelligence, but it does not consider the content already present in the editor. In other words, it simply transcribes what the user says without analyzing any existing text on the screen. It can be used to make final corrections to the report add new paragraphs, or even transcribe the entire report. It captures everything dictated, and if you make a mistake, you can correct it during the recording itself. Check out this example. Keep in mind that if you make a mistake, you can correct it during the recording itself. I'm going to edit a stone in the right kidney and switch to the left kidney. Presence of a kidney stone in the upper pole of the right kidney. No, I mean the left kidney. Measuring 0.4 centimeters. Note that he should only have a stone in the left kidney. You can also use it to make final corrections to your report, for example, presence of a bladder stone measuring 0.4 centimeters. Now let's understand how to create customized templates. Let's talk about creating templates. On the side menu, you will find the option to create custom templates. To add a new template, click the plus button in the upper corner to create an initial folder. Then, right-click on the folder and select Create Document. There are three steps. One, in the first step, enter the template name and type shortcut, which allows you to load the template using at. Two, in the second step, paste your desired template content. Three, in the third step, you can add command complements or predefined phrases for automatic replacement. For example, 
replace steatosis with liver with signs of increased fat content indicating hepatic steatosis and acute cholecystitis, distended gallbladder with thickened and irregular walls showing surrounding edema indicating acute cholecystitis. This way, the model will replace the keywords with the phrases you choose. At the end, click Register Template. Check out this example to see how easy it is to customize and call pathological phrases using the assistance instructions. Note that when you load your model, this blue button will be available for consultation. Your instructions and your pathological phrases. Let's go. Assistant, help me with this abdominal MRI for the suspected clinical indication of acute cholecystitis. Please include item 1 for steatosis and item 2 for acute cholecystitis. Also help me with the diagnostic impressions. Thank you. Notice that it correctly filled in the clinical suspicion. It also included hepatic steatosis in the liver and acute cholecystitis in the gallbladder. In the diagnostic impressions, it correctly filled in the diagnoses, making it much easier to draft the report. Finally, it is very important to know about the history button, which allows you to recover previous reports. If there is any internet instability and a report is not saved correctly, you can restore it using this option. These are the key functionalities of the platform. Explore the features and see how artificial intelligence can optimize your workflow. Thank you for choosing Radflow. We wish you great reports and a seamless experience. If you have any questions, we are always available to help.